Yo! Oh man, it is early. Oh my goodness. 3.54. Yeah, my alarm went off at 3.30. Now you guys see what I do for you. You know, trying to bring you this saucy little content here, you know. Sheesh, Bob. Save some for the rest of us. Today we're going to be on the old boat. We're going with Cameron again from Wing Chaser Outfitters. And in we, I mean me and my buddy Kel. Kel has never been on a YouTube video. The last time we hunted together, I actually didn't even have a YouTube channel. So, Kel is one of my close buddies. We used to work together a lot until I quit my job and took on YouTube full time. But the Excel boat giveaway. This is your last chance to enter here in September for the Ducks t-shirt subscription of the month. Now what that means is, this is the last chance to get this shirt. This shirt will be gone by the end of September, and then we'll be rolling on to October shirt. So if you buy any of the Ducks subscription shirts, you get them once every month, a different shirt. What that also does is every month, it enters you to win the Excel boat. So, fast food, last chance to get it. I'll link it in the description below. Go pick it up. But I'm gonna get on the road here. We have an hour and a half drive. That's why I got up at 3.30 for goodness sakes. <laughs> just send it, Cameron. Just send it, buddy. Keep coming. A little more. Oh, oh. Ah, dang, this sucker's got some weight to her. There she goes, okay. Well, almost set sail. Watch out. Whoa, watch your step, buddy. <laughs> Oh, hello, am I blinding you with my right headlamp? No, not at all. Everybody meet Kel. This is your first video you've been on. Yeah, well, not this kind of video. Yeah, well, my we YouTube videos, it. man. Yeah, oh. Oh. oh, you're talking about other type of videos you've been on. Previous lifestyle. Oh. oh look at the old twin motor setup old Cameron and Dalton got going on. Are the bugs nailing you, dude? Bugs are horrible. Well, we are here. Oh yeah. Hope you guys can see something on the old GoPro. But it is shooting light. But it's really dark. I'm sure this GoPro is not doing any justice. Come on. Yeah, definitely gonna be some sky busting today. Holy smokes, it's a war zone out here, people. You, you hear the shot? <laughs> I just heard shot land probably 50 foot behind us. Oh god, that was a big bug. Did you hear that? Oh yeah, two. Oh man, I couldn't shoot. He was too far out of my lane. Got got this. Got this close one. Yeah, buddy. First bird down. He dead. Boom. Well, two on the board. Great my here. my bird, I think, fell out there. Look at that group. Well, I'm going to find uh find my bird. I dropped it way out here. There we are. Oh man, that was a walk. Ooh, doggy. It is beautiful out here this morning. Lots of shooting going on, but it is beautiful. It's about right at 70 degrees, I think, and it could definitely be a little cooler. That's for sure. The mosquitoes have darn near carried me away already, but that's what till hunting is all about. Right here, single. Ba boom boom <laughs> yeah buddy that was sweet puffed his butt that was bad oh, look at him sitting pretty for dad oh stupid camera man i had to turn it on and it took way too long a little single coming Yeah, buddy. Four. I'm four on the board. Four on the board. Two more. Where's my bird? Where's my bird at? Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, that ain't bad. He's going the wrong way. 
Drake, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> well, we're doing it dirty out here. The shooting has slowed down. The war zone factor, you know, it's went down just a little bit. I think we got a 10 gauge about 100 yards behind us that blew my ears out from about 100 yards away. Not kidding. But, uh, like I said, shooting has slowed down. It's a nice morning. Good little breeze picking up here. Pennies. Yeah, three pack. They're pretty high. They're real high. <laughs> right here, right here, four. Shoot out back. Well, I don't think I hit a darn one. I hit that last. Oh, look at him. He says, I get away. Well, the, those birds did it really well, and I whiffed everyone. Didn't hit a single thing. Made a lot of noise, though. Hmm. Oh, there they are. Got them. Yep, three, baby. Don't let them leave, boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, we let two. Well, yeah, that one's wounded. Boom, he's down. Dropped one. Man, that bird fell way, way, way over there. But we got 11 on the board, not doing too bad. Four of us today. Just a good old public land hunt. If you guys like these public land hunts, you know what to do. Drop your boy a big old thumbs up. Oh, well, let's get a little bit of time checkeroni. We have not shot anything for quite some time. It is nine o'clock. I smoked a bird right here earlier, and when I came to look for it, I could not find it. I think he might have drowned himself. I'm out here to look again now that the sun's up. And I do not even see my the feather where I dusted the guy. Where in the heck? He must have drowned himself. I thought I piled him up, but that's what happens. If you guys have issues with losing ducks because they drown themselves, you know, you know how ducks do, they'll dive down and then they'll clamp on to the vegetation down there. If you guys have any issues with that, drop a comment down below because it seems like every time I come here, this happens. I lose ducks because they dive and drown themselves. at Cameron's setup here. He has a double motor here. <clears throat> Twin engine motor and these motors are actually from Harbor Freight. $200 a piece and then each shaft is $200 a piece. So total, what do you got in that bad boy? About $800. 800 bucks. Yeah. You know like the big, you know the big manufacturers, the big name companies out there, they're ridiculously expensive. You can spend three, four, five, six thousand dollars on a mud motor. If you want to make one for cheap and a good one for cheap, that's what you do. Oh, Dalton got it. Well, that was easy. Right on the edge. Thank goodness. Right on the edge. Yeah, that bird, uh, yeah, it looks like a decoy. Uh, that bird there, we sailed. It was a sailor, so uh, we had to bring the boat over and look for it. But we found it. It's always, if you sell birds, if they're, if they're far, far, you just, you gotta make sure you go look for them, people. Make sure you drive over there, you walk out there, and you gotta go look for them, even if they're, uh, quite a hike. Got to do it. I thought you found a decoy at first. Look at that guy. <laughs> Dude got scared straight. Oh, back home. Feels good. Three o'clock wake up time this morning. 
didn't feel so good. But total, we scratched out 11 with four guys. Uh, this is the second weekend a till have been open here in Kansas. We're still sitting around 88, 90 degrees every day. Last week it was a little cooler and the hunting wasn't bad on the on opening weekend. But now, I'm oh, sorry, I got nasty bloody hands. Just got done cleaning the birds. But shout out to Cameron yet again for getting me on a hunt. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. You guys need to go check out Cameron's guide service. I'll link it in the description below or just follow him on Instagram right here. He's a big snow goose hunter, so if you guys are wanting to get on the Kansas conservation hunts at the end of February when it opens up, I'd be getting a hold of him, DMing him on the old Instagram. But if you guys want to win that Excel boat, this one right here, when you sign up for the Ducks T-Shirt of the Month subscription, you are automatically entered to win the Excel boat that we're giving away. It has a Mud Buddy motor on it and a complete duck blind. Literally valued over $18,000 this boat we're giving away. But the more t-shirts you sign up for, the more chances you're entered to win that boat. So go down in the description if you're interested in entering the boat giveaway. I will link the t-shirt subscription in the description below. Go check it out. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like these duck hunts, if you like this one in particular, drop a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe if you haven't. I will see all you guys on the next one. Thank you for being here. Thank you for enjoying the channel. And thank you for always dropping your positive comments down below. I love all the positive vibes that you guys provide down below. I really enjoy it. Thank you guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Girls, weather ever turns a box. Come on, man. It ain't like I'm a swinging on the floor.